Yo, what's up my peoples? In today's Tower of Fantasy video, um, I want to explain something before I start. I know it's been a long time since I've been playing, but when Honkai Star Rail came out, of course I started thinking about this game. Even though I haven't played Genshin Impact to this day, and my son wants to kill me for it, and that right son. You just kind of want to slap me a little bit though, right? Huh? Yes or no? It? No? Just a little bit? No? Oh, he's being nice. Anyway. This is not right. Okay. But, with that being said, what happened was in my last live stream that I did a Tower of Fantasy, and it's been weeks ago, but when I did this live stream, everything went wrong. Like, I made progress, but I didn't. The sound was messed up. So what I'm doing in this video, and hopefully that'll be okay, and I won't get in trouble for it. Uh, the footage that you're about to see is from Ruben's channel, and Ruben is a really good YouTuber. I'll leave a link to his channel in the description. It is not my footage, so but I'm only gonna show like some cutscenes, and this is gonna be from the parts that you guys missed, the cutscenes you guys missed. And after that, I'm just gonna give you you know like straight gameplay like you normally see from me. So I hope you guys enjoy. But this is what you miss. Uh, from my messed up live stream, courtesy of Ruben's uh, coverage of Tower of Fantasy. Let's do this. Yeet! That was a terrible yeet. It's late, y'all. It's late. How's Shirley holding up? She overloaded her suppressor to create the shield, but that exposed her to excessive amounts of Omnium radiation. We stabilized her condition with some medication, but we can't say for sure if she's in the clear. The shelter's a mess. Those Ravengers raided our warehouse. Celine and I will have to clean things up. Zeke's with Shirley right now. You should go see her. She's in the infirmary. Zeke, is Shirley all right? She's out of danger, for now. But it still doesn't look good. This is all my fault. Can she be treated? The shelter's only equipped with basic medical equipment. We've done all we can. Celine is trying to contact some friends in Banjis to see if any of them can help. I'm going to talk to Franz. He's got some connections. Maybe he'll have some ideas. Please take care of Shirley while I'm gone. I'll be back as soon as I can. heard you guys. Zeke, he's gone to see Franz, right? Well, how is it? Give it to me straight, Doc. I'm so sorry. I made everyone so worried. I... Sorry. I'm feeling a little hungry. Could you get me something? <laughs> Anything, really. Thanks. here I I just wanted to see the stars I'm sorry I just I just want to be alone just for a little while when we were little Zeke used to take me out here to gaze at the stars I like it here it's so quiet and peaceful like all the bad things in the world just didn't exist I wish things could be like back then. Forever. I... I didn't want to make Zeke sad. Shirley, are you okay? I... what am I gonna do? Shirley! I'm sorry, Zeke. This was all my fault. It's not your fault. Her condition's worse than we thought. I should have been watchful. We did a full checkup on her. Her conditions are not stable and may take a turn for the worst at any time. Celine's friends are coming to help, but they won't be here at least until tomorrow. We don't have that kind of time. <sighs> I need your help again. There's someone. Someone who may have a way of saving Shirley. 
There's an abandoned lab near the northern coast of Astra. Just send the word there. Also, please don't mention this to anyone else in the shelter. I'm sorry. I can't tell you the identity of that person. You're the only one in the shelter who can help me. It's hopeless. Just look at her. Is there no Everyone calm down. No, we have to follow the rules. I'll figure out a way. Shirley's not a monster. I'll make her better. things are around there. If one of us changed, the closest to them will have to put them down. The very least, they can go with some dignity. None of us wanted to see this happen to Shirley, but Zeke, he... Paul and I will stay here to keep everyone calm. As for Zeke... I'll go check on them. Okay, guys. So, that will catch you guys up with where I'm at. And... You guys should also know that Echo is a probably a limited time offer, but it was free for me. So you guys might want to check that out as well. If you want to get Echo, you have to go to the Simulacra to kind of like access it. But if you want her, you should get out there and get it. So right now we're going to inform a pop, inform Paula of Ziku's departure and see where this thing goes. So, I may not do that many of my own personal missions in this, but, uh, I think this could be cool. Also, I've learned that in this game, that it costs you dark crystals to change your appearance, so, may not be changing my appearance that much. What? Zeke took Shirley and left with someone. Why didn't you stop him? Stop him? You know him better than I do. Hm. So who exactly was it? The heirs of Ida. They claim that they can save Shirley. For Zeke, the choice was clear as day. Heirs of Ida? The crazies that tried to overthrow Hykros? How did they get involved in this? Because... Zeke and Shirley's parents were once members of the heirs of Ida. What? Why hasn't Zeke mentioned this before? What happened to his parents was a meaningless tragedy. 
They were merely victims of the conflict between Hykros and the heirs of Ida. Surely Zeke wants nothing else now but a calm and peaceful life, right? But now, Shirley's become the heirs of Ida's greatest bargaining chip. They want Zeke, and Zeke would do anything to save his sister. Could the heirs of Ida be behind the Ravager's attack? I can't say for sure, but I know that they're willing to do anything it takes to achieve their goal. We must get Zeke back. We can't let him be a pawn of those lunatics. Leave it to me. I'll find Zeke. The heirs of Ida are not to be taken lightly. You don't have to do this. They saved my life. I'm only returning the favor. Palu, the shelter just went through a rough time. Right now, it's of utmost importance to rebuild it and restore order. None of which can be accomplished without you. Just leave the matter of Zeke to us. I'm planning to take the kid to Hykros and inform them of everything that happened here. Maybe they can help. Thank you, Mr. Franz. Don't even mention it. I've arranged for some transportation for you. It's parked outside. When you're all set, we'll head for the Omnium Tower. Thank <laughs> you.